of uh, Stephen Hawking when he wrote the ver the very uh, big seller, A Brief History of Time, was warned by his publisher that because no, we knew who he was professionally, but the public really didn't know about him at the time, or, or that he's in a wheelchair or it's par you know paralyzed, has this this debilitating condition, and. <clears throat> So we know about him, but not that that's relevant. I just want to say he was not known at the time. So the publisher said, uh, our research shows that for every equation you put in the book, the potential audience is cut in half. <laughs> wow. So one equation is half, <laughs> two equations is one fourth, three equations, one eighth. You know, you just do the one half to the n wow. power. Okay. And okay. so I think there, there might have been two or three equations in it, and it was one of the biggest selling books of all time. And, and Imagine if he hadn't put them in. <laughs> <laughs> There'd be one on every person, though. Right. <laughs> the Rational View is a weekly series hosted by me, Dr. Alan Scott, providing a rational, evidence-based perspective on important societal issues.